Searching for answers after a 16 year old disappeared. This is Kaylee Phillips. She was last seen early yesterday morning at a campsite at Fort Yargo State Park in Winder. That's about 50 miles northeast of Atlanta. Atlanta News First, Bridget Spencer, live from the Winder Police Department tonight. Bridget, the GBI you've learned is now involved. That's right. And you know, this family is really close knit. They travel everywhere together. They say they even homeschool their children. Now, Kaylin's mother was out of town. In fact, she was overseas on a work trip when she found out this was happening and she flew back here as soon as possible. I just just want her to be home. Tonight, a mother and a father searching for answers. 16 year old Kaylin Phillips was last seen around 1:30 in the morning at a campground in Fort Yargo State Park. Her father discovered she was gone when he woke up and saw the back door of their family camper open. Her cell phone's there, her wallet, her IDs, her credit cards, not even a jacket is missing. So everything she owns is here. Tuesday, police shut down the park for a canine search. At this time, we've just been kind of exhausting all investigative efforts. Uh, we have worked with local resources to try to uh, conduct searches. But she was still nowhere to be found, and the search is leaving her family heartbroken and worried. Kaylin has never, ever run away before. This is a child who still likes to rub her mama's feet and talk all night and who's like, mom, let's do this new devotional as a family. She's never been in trouble. Misty Phillips says her daughter had just scheduled a visit to UGA and to get her driver's license. Her younger sister's now helping in the search effort. Now I have a five year old who's drawn missing posters for her sister. Kaylin Phillips is five foot four, around 140 pounds. She may be wearing glasses and white Puma tennis shoes. The Winder Police Department is also offering a reward for information that can lead them to her. And tomorrow the family is hosting a prayer vigil that's going to be at First Baptist Church of Carl. That's happening at six o'clock tomorrow. If you know where Kaylin may be, you are urged to give the Winder Police Department a call. We're live in Winder, Bridget Spencer, Atlanta News First. Lawmakers.